CBC cross border program between Republic of Macedonia and Republic of Albania is implementing under the second component of the instrument for pre accession assistance program of the European Union. Ministry of Integration from Albania and Ministry for Local Self Government from Macedonia are operating structure responsible for its implementation. This program covers a territory of about 20,000 square meters on both sides of the borders with uh, uh, more than 1.5 million inhabitants. During the implementation of this program, three call proposals have been launched with uh, uh, financial allocations of grants from the European Union of about 9.5 million. 2,266 applications have been submitted out of which 51 successful applications have been contracted with the, a grant of the European Union of about 7.5 million. The Joint Technical Secretariat in Struga and its antenna Elbasan is a joint administrative body of the program responsible for the day-to-day -day management of the program and for administrative arrangements. The GTS Struga and its antenna Elbasan is supporting the operation structure, the joint monitoring committee, the grant beneficiaries and the potential applicants. In the past period, JTS and Antenna have organized 70 info session and partner search forum with more than 900 participants and 22 trainings for potential applicants with more than 350 participants. In order to support the grant beneficiaries in implementation of their projects, we have conducted more than 120 monitoring visits and on-the-spot support. To ensure the visibility of the program, there have been developed and distributed promotional materials, a website has been created and different visibility events have been organized. GTS through Antenel Passan has organized seven trainings for the grant beneficiary in order to help them to implement their project successful. Crossing Border for Change is the name of this project. It was implemented by Unegruaja from Albania, Pogradec and from local development agency from Struga, Macedonia. Uh, the main goal of the project was to enable the social integration of long-term unemployed women and young women just entering the workforce. Uh, among the many results of the project, the most important result is uh, delivering 24 different workshops mainly on how to find a job, how to develop a business, how to gain more self-confidence when searching for a job. And we have included 120 women from Macedonian and from Albanian sites to be participating on these workshops. We also had uh, four study trips, women from Macedonia, visiting Albania and other way around. And this project was part of the IPA cross-border cooperation program with Albania and Macedonia. And uh, what has remained from this project is that these 120 women, they have gained a huge experience on how to search for a job. And also we have delivered, uh, developed a special curriculum intended on helping not just women, but also all the people searching for a job on this job market in Macedonia and in Albania. Shoqata e gruës aureola në bashkëpunime me Shoqata në përqështës sociale arriti të realizoj projektin fuqizimi gruës në zona turistike për mes prodhimeve të dorës, projekt i cili arriti të siel një qëllim që kishte vazhdimin dhe trajnimin e grave, të cilat gra do të arrinin të punonin duke u bazuar në pundore ose dhe në ushqime tradicionale. Në të njëtën ko mund themi se organizua panajire, panajire në të cilat arritet një numër i madhë për mira vetë është të majnë pjesë, panajire në të cilin patë në rast edhe turistët, edhe vendasit, të njifen me gjërat të cilat gratë të una punuan, me pondore të tyre, me ushqimet të tyre. Mund themi se dëshira e grave për vazhdim të këti projekti është mjaftë të madhe, me qenë se atu për herë të parë pa të në mundësin të ndjehen se mund të bëjnë diska dhe ato vetë. The use of artware is hard to talk, exchange between artists working in the social field, is a collaboration project realized in partnership between Cultural Center Media Artists from Macedonia and the Refraction Association from Albania. 
The overall objective of the 12-month project was to establish a network of civil society cultural organizations, local social institutions, uh, groups of artists and individual artists who use the art in the work with uh, vulnerable groups. As a result, uh, a series of trainings were realized, uh, which helped the capacity building of the artists and the local uh, social institutions. Um, an online resource center was established, uh, as well as a series of local pilot activities uh, in which artists were working directly with uh, the vulnerable groups. Uh, one of the four final products of the project is the manual for the use of art in the work with vulnerable groups, which was produced in Macedonian uh, and Albanian languages. Sociata e grave me probleme sociale, se bashkë me sociatën Aureola e Strugës, në periudën kohore pril viti 2012, tëtor vit 2013, implementoj projektin e IPA Cross Border me bështetjen e qarku të korqës dhe me bështetjen financiare të bashkimit Europian. Ky projekt ushtri në zonat turistike, tushemisht dhe voskopoj. Projekti titulli cili të është fuqizimi ekonomik i grave në përmjet punimeve të dores në këto zona, bëri të mundur gritjen e tre inkubatorve, pikërisht në tushemisht, voskopoj dhe struk. Të tre inkubatoret i dhanë shtys të madhe fuqizimit ekonomik të grave, duke e patur si proces jo vetëm punimet të dores, por edhe shqitjet e tyre sigurisht edhe eksperiencat të ndryshme në përmjet grave të struges, voskopojes dhe tushemishtit. Ndërko, kjo projekt kishtë në pjesën e përvërjës e saj, ngritja në një guide turistike, sot pas një viti të projektit mund të themi që komunat tushemish dhe voskopoj, jo vetëm që kjo projekt po vazhdonë, por ndihet shumë mirë dhe të turistët të cilet e vizitojnë pikrish të dy inkubator. Within the framework of the first call for proposal within the IPA cross-border program, Dorcas Albania applied with the project. The objective and the overall objective of the project was building pathways together for employment opportunities in the cross-border area. The first step, we tried to transfer the knowledge and the know-how and the best experiences from one country to, to the other. In Albania, we had the experience, long experience in the job business center, which had to do with the employment of the young people and especially targeting the Roma and Gypsy community. Of course, we as Dorcas Albania believe that change must come within society and uh, that people must take initiatives and act to change their situation. And we believe in the principle of the EU regarding the cross-border program and in the principle of transferring the knowledge and the best practices from one country to the other, uh, thus having a win-win situation for both countries and people. Actually, uh, Dorcas Albania is implementing uh, a project together with uh, Macedonian partners uh, called From Trash to Cash. This project uh, is being implemented under the, th the third call for proposal of the IPA cross-border program. Uh, the overall objective of the project is uh, to protect the environment and uh, to establish an efficient uh, waste recycling program. Uh, up to now, we have implemented several activities. Uh, we started our work with uh, creating and establishing our uh, project team. We also uh, have uh, uh, organized several coordination meetings with our Macedonian partners. We have set up the general uh, action plan. Uh, the project uh, has started its implementation in November 2013. 
and through various, uh, the implementation of various activities, uh, we aim to reach several results. Our project team is committed to implement this project successfully.